What's up, world? It's your girl, Nita B, a.k.a. Young Show, a.k.a. Back with another video. And if this y'all first time coming across my channel, y'all done clicked into the video. So if y'all ain't subscribed, man, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Go on like this video and don't forget to turn the post notification bells on to all, you feel me? Put it on all so y'all know every time I'm dropping these videos, you know what I'm saying? Because we going up, you feel me? We on the road to a thousand subscribers. We halfway down. So if you ain't subscribed yet and you in here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so y'all know what's going down every time I'm coming in this thing. Because it's going off for real. So today... Y'all done clicked on that video because y'all seen what we doing. Y'all seen what's going on. We trying the 90s most iconic cocktails. Like, y'all know we was lit. Like, I wasn't really that person. That, like, I was little. But the 90s was lit. Like, they had Freak Nick, uh, Players Ball, all that. So, y'all know they was drunk as the skunk in them things. So, I'm finna try all the iconic 90s um cocktails and i got this idea from tiktok i want to say it was tiktok and google you know google be knowing everything like google be lurking so i got five iconic cocktails i'm finna try so man stay tuned because it's about to go down we about to get lit so if y'all want to pause the video right now I'm going to put it in the description on what kind of drinks I'm getting. If y'all want to drink it with me, go ahead, pause it right now, go and get them drinks because we finna get turned up, you feel me? Be back in the city. All right, y'all, so drink number one is the Faux Loco. Now, y'all mama know these Faux Locos used to have you really going loco. Like, they really had people in the streets going crazy, getting butt naked, getting butt wild. Faux Loco, this big thing right here cost me, what, like $3? So, if y'all... For loco, we gonna see what this thing tastes like. I ain't never been big on these four loco, but they was very popular. Get the look. This video is not for people under 21. Just to say it like that. I ain't endorsing underage drinking. 21 and over, if you feel me. Let me go on ahead. Turn up. Okay. This is a premium malt liquor beverage with artificial flavoring. This is the apple version, and it's a little bitter. It tastes a little beerish to me. It got 14% alcohol. Ugh. Would I, would I drink this all the time? I mean, hold on, let me do it. Uh-uh, I don't like it. It's sour, I can't, I can't do that. What you think? It's sour, huh? Yeah, I should've got a different flavor because that apple just ain't. You want to drink. That apple. <laughs> the apple ain't apple, you know what I'm saying? Maybe so, if you eat some jolly ranches. Jolly ranches? Apple jolly ranches to the bottom. Maybe it might swing it up. Okay, this is Natalie. Anyway, <laughs> the faux loco is not a go for me. I do not want to get. Now I see why people going crazy because this stuff is nasty. Anyway, next cocktail because my whole throat no. All right, y'all, cocktail number two. We gonna move on to some vodka. We got some taco vodka. Now, if y'all from the hood, y'all know what taco vodka is. And we got the Red Bull. We gonna do the iconic Red Bull and vodka cocktail. So, we gonna mix a little bit. Cause y'all, I ain't trying to get tore up now, man. I'm, I got like five cocktails I'm finna try and I ain't trying to be. I wanna remember them all. Well, hell, I mean, I don't want to remember the night. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. All right. Just put a little bit. Y'all see that? It's that Red Bull and that vodka. Go and get that taco. Got that Red Bull and that vodka. Bow. Yeah. I ain't even drunk it yet. I'm already lit. That four loco crazy. Hold on. Let me see. Oh, okay. I can do this. This is something I can sip on if I go to the club or to a bar. So I can really... Yeah, I can hit that. 
Let me hit that. Yeah, don't drink all my stuff. This is so damn This is so stuff right here to have you lit in the club. You know make what I'm saying? Home and just take I got it in my little food. margarita glass. Yeah. I can deal with this. The vodka in the Red Bull. Yeah. I get this a 10. Like, this is really lit. And I got some cheap vodka. Like, I ain't get the premium vodka. I got the top. The Taco and the Red Bull. That's a go for me. They did something then. I bet this was the popular drink up there. You feel me? In the 90s, I bet this was the one everybody had in the club. But yeah, the Four Loco was a no. The Red Bull and the uh, Vodka, let's go. We finna go to the third one. All right, y'all, so it's cocktail number three, and y'all already know it's very popular. They had a whole song to it. It's called that Gin and Juice. Lay back with my mind on my money and my money on my mind. No. Gin and we got some apple juice. I'm not lifting this big thing of apple juice up. No, I'm I think I'm gonna put some red bull. Ain't red bull juice? Or should I put the apple juice? I don't know, but we finna do we got the seagram. No, this is not seagram tail. This new Amsterdam gin. We're gonna put a little bit in my got some new ass. Man, if y'all trying these at home, please don't get too lit. And please be over 21, because I'm not condoning underage drinking at all, guys. That is not what I'm doing. I'm just simply tasting alcoholic beverages for the adults here. Okay, so, boom. We got that gin and juice. I always wanted to try this. Like, I never did gin and juice. Like, real talk, I have done... I'm really a brown drinking person. Like, I really, like, if I drink, I do some crown or some Hennessy. But I don't really do white because it don't, it don't really make me feel right. But gin and juice. Toast. Mm. Ooh. I'm going to tell you one thing. That gin, they say it make you sin because that's so strong. Okay. And it got like a, I don't know if it's just New Amsterdam, but that gin, I, man, you get too, oh, I only took a sip and I already feel it like, man, this cocktail number three and I got two more. So I need to slow down. I need to slow down. Woo! I don't think I put no juice in that. I put too much, I put too much gin or something. It's good, it's strong. If you wanna get messed up, this the one right here, cause it's gin, wanna get toe up? I'ma say it's the gin and the juice, then the vodka and the bull. That's what I'ma go with. It's the gin and juice and the vodka and the bull. That four loco just need to go, cause I ain't, I can't mess with that at all. Like, I ain't. Trying to look at it, smell it, smell it. It smells good, but the smell is so deceiving. I should have got other flavor or something. I don't know. But apple ain't it. So we're going to go to four. All right, y'all. So cocktail number four is one of them, like, I think this a ghetto. <laughs> I think this ghetto. I don't know. I think it's straight from the hood, straight up, because I ain't never went to a big establishment and seen these. Maybe I'm just tripping. I don't know. I never really had these personally, but we're going to go with these Buzz Balls cocktails. Like, it's a already a cocktail that's mixed in and it's supposed to be hella strong. Like, it's, it's like, well, it's only 15% alcohol, but they say this thing gets you lit. And you gonna be on your snit, uh, you feel me? So I gotta shake it well. Let me stop shaking my caramel. Let me be shaking the table. You gotta shake it real good. That's what it say on the thing. Shake well. Say shake well. So I got the green apple. No, I got the forbidden. It's the forbidden apple. I think this the apple Eve bit off of. They put it in their cocktail. They put, they got the uh, apple Eve bit off of and put it in their cocktail, you feel me? Boy, if you don't get it. Now I'm just playing. But yeah, this is the forbidden apple buzz ball. You're gonna hit it down. 
Y'all don't take it up. I'm gonna put it bottom chain. Okay, so it ain't as bad as the faux loco, cause that faux loco just went in it. I can't, I can really, like, it ain't strong, but if you chug it, I feel like you both chug this. If you chug this, chug it, it'll be chugging. I'm not chugging chug. nothing, cause I got no, you stay in the back. <laughs> like, no. Like, chugging, I got, I ain't trying to be toe off, man. No. Yeah. I can, I can mess with a buzz ball. You telling me to chug and you looking ugly. <laughs> anyway. I got to drive home. Anyway. So I can't be chugging. That buzz ball, it go number three. It go number three. So, so far, we got the... Mm -mm. Baby, that tastes like apple juice. That's what I'm saying. It don't taste. It tastes good. Like it tastes like. I, this shit gonna kick in on me. Yeah, it gonna kick in. Nobody call it a buzz ball. So this still number three though. I still can't. Nah, this go number two. I ain't gonna even count. That gin and juice was number three. This is two, and that vodka and that uh Red Bull number one for me. That vodka and that Red Bull gonna be the one for me. I think so. But we got one more cocktail, you feel me? One more. Now, the last one, I try to say the best one for last. Because I feel like it's going to put me on my hands. <laughs> for real. Like, All right, y'all. So, I got the last cocktail. I saved it for last. Y'all already know what it is. Man, it's thick the passion, baby. Yeah. Two <laughs> No, no. <laughs> Tupac said it himself, man. You mix that little hypnotic and Hennessy, addicted to moving key, baba la baba bees. That's that thing. Hypnotic? Hypnotic? Exotic? I'm going out my body. It, anyway, I've been drinking too much. <laughs> I'm lit, for real. All right, so what you do is put a little hypnotic and a little Hennessy. We got the Hennessy and Coke because I can. I just ain't, I just didn't have the money for the regular, but it, it'll do, we got Hennessy in it now. All right, so I'm putting a little hypnotic. I bet this still gonna be weird. Like, Tupac, what the hell was you on, man? The mix is brown and hypnotic. Like, we gonna see. We shall see. Right. All right, so it turned it. This pretty. Blue, it turned it into like a, a a brownish blue. Cause I ain't add a lot. Cause I ain't trying to mess my stomach up. I don't really know the measurements. They didn't have the measurements on the internet. They just told me what to put in now. But I know what hypnotic tastes like by itself, and I know what this uh Hennessy and Coke tastes like by itself. But I ain't had it together. We gonna see if Tupac can add something that I, you know, that ain't nobody else think of. You know what I'm saying? Well, it like sweet and tangy. I like it. Okay, Tupac. Rest in peace, Tupac. Go out a little look. This is it. I mean, for real. Like, I ain't. I ain't even playing, like, hey, the fact. That's why they were saying when they was drinking that. Give me that the passion. Maria, try that. No cap. Yo, no cap out of all the cocktails. I'm putting this number one, the passion number one. That Red Bull and that vodka has to be number two. The Buzz Ball is number three. The Gin and Juice is number four. And that Four Loco can really go. <laughs> like, that Four Loco is a hell no for me. Like, I, I ain't messing with no Four Loco, bro. That Four Loco ain't it at all. But this Thug Passion, man, y'all gotta try this. Like, all of them, y'all can try them yourself. Tell me what y'all think about it. Leave some comments down below if y'all that actually had these before. 
and y'all like them or didn't like them. I don't know, but this my this my favorite one. I did say the best for last, the best is that thug passion. I'ma start. I don't know. I might start drinking it when I go out. I'm a man. I might leave, but it ain't even leaving Brown alone. I already mess with Brown. I just ain't never think to put it with no hypnotic. Like that's crazy. Good thing I did this video though, cause now I got a new drink. And if y'all have stayed in this video this long and y'all liking these drinks and y'all liking all the good content that we putting on, man, go ahead, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you ain't subscribed yet, and go ahead, turn them post notification bells off so y'all can know every time I'm dropping these bangers because, man, I am getting into the getting into. And, man, we almost at a 1,000. We yet almost, well, we really almost at 400, but after 400, it's a thousand in my mind. All y'all gotta do is hit the subscribe button. It's gonna, pew, it's gonna be up there. We gonna be there. All you gotta do is be there. What I said in the last video, man, get me up there with them up there. I'm trying to be up there with them up there. So, man, if y'all messing with the content or y'all, you know, y'all want to see something, y'all have some content that uh, y'all might want to see, go ahead, drop it down in the comments, let your girl know. We going up, I can't slow down, I can't go down. We going up, I'm be around, so y'all stay around. Man, I'm just rambling, but these drinks kick it in, like for real, for real. So go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Hit the subscribe button, man, and until next time, man, y'all already know what's up. We lit, peace.